If you're looking for the best or at least the most dynamic quarterback battle of this weekend's playoff games, you can look no further than in Carolina on Sunday, Colin Kaepernick at Cam Newton. I'm Kevin Clark with, his, with me is my editor, Jeff Foster. Jeff, what do you like in this one? I think both quarterbacks are great. I think they're both going to be big stars for a long time. Right now, I can't go against Kaepernick and the way he's playing right now with a lot of confidence and he's running the ball more, which is sort of like a weapon they haven't used all year. And having Crabtree back, they, be, they haven't lost. And if you look back at that game they played against Carolina, they didn't have Crabtree, and Vernon Davis left the game early. Those are his two best weapons. He has a full arsenal. He looks really strong right now. It's hard to go against that. Carolina defense is terrific. They got a lot of great stars on that team. But this year, I think I like the way the Niners yeah. are playing right now. Okay, the way to get to Kaepernick, a lot of these running quarterbacks is to pressure them. Send some D-linemen up the field, get in his face. Here's the problem for San Francisco. They've got a lot of pass rushers, and if you send those kind of guys at Cam Newton, he's still going to make the throws. He's one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL when those guys in his face. I think he has over 50% completion percentage when he's under pressure. That's unbelievable mm -hmm. as far as a quarterback like him. He'll be able to get away from Alden Smith, from Justin Smith. These sort of pass rushers who can basically take out the Drew Brees and Peyton Mannings of the world, mm -hmm. he can get away from that and run free either 15 yards or complete a pass downfield to Greg Olson or Steve Smith. I just really think that Cam Newton has developed into this sort of almost unstoppable being, and there's really nothing that San Francisco can do except for drop five guys back and hope for an mm -hmm. interception. So I surprisingly like Carolina in this one. Surprisingly. Well, I mean, I think every all, all the conventional wisdom is going to San Francisco That's right true. now. Yeah. And I just think that the other thing is that Cam Newton can, can complete really good short passes kind of in between the linebackers and the defensive line. That's a weakness for San Francisco. So I like Carolina, maybe by two or three touchdowns.